Every day brings a new challenge and every day brings a new solution. It all depends how you look at it and how you frame it. I'm actually in New York today and it's Friday morning and I am here because I am driving to do my home flipping workshop that we've been doing now for almost five years and so we do them virtually now and I am driving to that right now. I had to fly here and here's my challenge. My, my mom was hospitalized. She's doing well. Thank you for all the, the words and messages and stuff. She's doing better now. She'll be home soon but she's hospitalized in New York. And I had to fly here to do this virtual event because I'm all set up in New York. Well, wouldn't you know it, my flight, two of my flights were canceled the night before I was supposed to be here on Wednesday. And then Thursday morning, my, my next flight was canceled again by a different airline. So we had to get on a third airline to get me here. That meant I had to get up at 3.45 in the morning, uh, two mornings ago, 3.45 in the morning to catch a 4.15 Uber to get to the airport to pray I got here on time and I had meetings and I had get togethers with my team and I had to go see my mom in the hospital and oh my gosh, all kinds of stuff. Now look at, I know that you guys have been following me. You see the past month we've had some challenges. Oh my gosh, it's been one thing after the other. And they're not, you know, at the end of the day, I, I keep telling myself there are worse things in life. It's not that bad, but definitely challenges every day. And so as I was thinking about, as I was driving to my home flipping workshop today, which I'm very excited about, about 300 people are gonna be in attendance virtually, and it's gonna be a killer weekend. I know it's gonna be great, but I'm just telling you this, every, no matter what you do in life, there are gonna be challenges. And so you have a choice, right? You can either fold over and say, I can't do it, it's too much, and just quit the journey wherever you are, or you just keep pressing on. And I don't know any different. My mom raised me, so I just, I don't know any different. I just keep pressing on no matter what, because I know that if I want to get to my goal, whatever that goal is, I'm going to have to press on no matter what. So I encourage you today as you're out there going for your goals, you're going to have challenges, right? You're going to have flights canceled multiple times. You're going to have things happen that don't work. Technology won't be in your favor. There's going to be things that happen. Whoa, I have to cut somebody off here. How you doing? Sorry about that. Um, and there's going to be things that happen. It's really your choice on how you deal with it, right? And I'm, I'm sharing these things with you in my life so you can see, because I think people think when you get to a certain level of success that everything just works itself out. And I'm telling you, it doesn't. As a matter of fact, the, the more successful you get in a lot of ways, the more challenges you get, the more challenges you have to overcome and you have to deal with. So it's in the way that you deal with those challenges that determines your ultimate success in life and your ultimate happiness. So again, am I great at it all the time? No, I'm not perfect, but I keep working and keep pressing on. So just keep remember this. One thing I wanna leave with you with today is this. Keep pressing on, no matter what, when you've got problems in front of you and things happening and you're going for a goal, no matter how small, no matter how big, you gotta press on. I didn't know if I was gonna make it here today for this workshop, you guys. The flights were canceling around me like crazy. I didn't know if I was gonna make it. But at the end of the day, I did make it, right? So it's how you deal with those challenges that determine your ultimate success in life. So remember, press on no matter what. Whatever your goal is, keep pressing on, keep pushing, keep pressing, and you will find the solution. They always say when a door closes, a window opens, or a window closes, a door opens. It's true, you just have to go out there and look for it. So I'm excited, I'm about to walk in my building here and get mic'd up to do my three-day home flipping workshop. You know, just a quick plug here, if you guys have never been to one, come to one of my workshops. We have a great time at those. We talk about a lot of these things and real estate investing and everything to help people use real estate as a tool to get from where you are to where you wanna go because the finances in that can make big changes in your life. So I uh, hope to see some of you there today. Maybe some of you guys are watching this morning. I you better not be watching this morning because I'm actually talking live to you. So, all right, guys, talk to you soon. Remember, there's a ton of opportunity out there today. Go out there and get yours. You deserve it.